We got a fun little car here, a 1962 Chevy Nova convertible. It's been upgraded with a 327 under the hood, a turbo 350 automatic, some disc brakes, nicely restored convertible for not a lot of money. Go to volocars.com. That's where you find price tags on every one of our cars, along with a monthly finance option as well. But right now that tops down. Let's go for a spin. Yeah, real nice car. Bought it from a, a customer of ours. I haven't talked to him in a few years, but he's owned this car for a number of years. And uh, we just purchased it from him. It's in really great shape. It flew through the shop, actually. Uh, our inspection process, I think they fixed a ground on a turn signal bulb or something like that. And that's about it. So anyway, I'm looking at a laser beam straight uh, sheet metal, the hood, the fender, I mean, not a ripple, lines up beautifully, smooth along the bottom, no bubbles, absolutely straight. Same thing up here. I'm looking across the trunk, not even a little whoop-de-doo or ripple or nothing. It is absolutely straight. Has the thin, literally hairline crack. That's where a seam is, the convertibles. All crack there, and on this side, this side just uh, maybe a centimeter long. Absolutely clean, straight. Uh, there is a chip on the edge of the gas cap right here. Paint is chipped. All excellent, clean, straight. No rust, no damage. Lines up, spot on. Door button pushes in real easily. Shuts real nice. Spot on, straight, clean. Body is really, really nice on this car. And it is painted lipstick red. It's smooth and glossy. It's like looking into a mirror. Um, you know, I don't really see imperfections. There's some mild chipping, like almost like under the trim, just sticking out a little bit. There's some little chips in the paint there. There's some little little speckles, little very, very minor imperfection. The chrome is sparkling. You got 327 cross flag emblems, windshields crystal clear that must be new. The gaskets replaced. Overall, the chrome and trim is real nice. The vent window frame is shiny chrome, has bow tie mirrors on both sides. Uh, this trim must have been straightened and polished, although there's some minor imperfections. Door handle looks like new. Yeah, same thing on this side. Very, very easy to open and close. The Nova emblem sparkling. Tail lights, trim, bumper, emblem, all that's in excellent shape. Convertible top's a black canvas top. That costs twice as much money as a vinyl top. It's real rich looking, looks real nice, fits real nice. Uh, sitting on some rally wheels. Uh, the trim is real nice. Tires look real good. Yeah, it's a really nice car. Weather strips have been replaced. And up front here, uh, here's a little chip on the paint right here on the corner. Bumper shiny. And I, I'm 99% sure it's a custom grill. Looks like a custom grill to me. Uh, just a nice, good-looking car. Exceptionally clean. Let's open it up, see if the uh, inside lives up to the outside. All right, this trunk really springs into action. You just turn it, boy, it, it flew, flew open all on its own. But look how slick this is painted, shiny, new hardware, new weather strip, painted beautifully. Inside is completely dry, clean metal. It's been re-spatter painted very neatly. Well liners replaced. They've relocated the battery uh, into the trunk compartment. Clean trunk. Actually, this whole car is very exceptional. I don't know if I was enthusiastic enough when I was describing the outside. It is straight. It is shiny. It is clean. Just look at the door jams. Look at the weather strips. Uh, not only are they new, but they, they fit nicely. Custom upholstery. The door panels are custom made. Look how all the stitching is straight. There's no wrinkles. The armrests, the window cranks, door handles, it's all new. All the metal trim inside the car is painted up real nice, so all this looks really good. You're looking at nice knobs, bezel, instruments, has the factory gauge cluster, 
They've added a tachometer in the middle, but it's a factory style. It does have a retro stereo fill in the space right here, but there is a modern stereo with the remote hidden in the glove box here. Uh, kick panels are upholstered to match the door panels. Real nice carpet with Nova floor mats. Yeah, B&M ratchet shifter. They actually installed seat belts. They weren't a law yet. These are aftermarket seat belts. They put enough in for three people up front. Uh, looks like two people in the back. Again, very nice custom upholstery. The cushions, nice and firm. Do you see a wrinkle anywhere? Uh, not on my face, though, just the seats. Real nice job, front and back. Got rear floor mats. The rear armrests are covered real nicely. And then it does have the convertible boot. They just didn't slide it through this rail. It slides right in there and that'll fit real nice. So the interior is as nice as the exterior. Got a cushion grip grant steering wheel. Yeah, nice, uh, nice quality car. We got a buy it now button on our website. Hit that button before someone beats you to it. So this is a 327 engine. In a little car like this, this is plenty of motor. Uh, got a little bit hotter cam, Edelbrock intake, Edelbrock four barrel carb with electric choke, HEI electronic ignition in the back, set of coated headers, dressed up with some nice chrome. And then again, look at the paintwork, the whole engine bay. Just nice, clean metal. You can tell they started with a clean car. This is all much too nice. Of course, it's been scuffed and painted, but the metal is straight, square, clean. Then we got a chrome alternator, upgraded to a dual reservoir, uh, master cylinder. And then up front is an aluminum radiator with electric fan, overflow bottle, fuel pump looks new. You can work on this engine. You can change the spark plugs yourself. All right, Caleb's going to take you for a ride and have fun. Right, guys 62 Nova we're going out on a test drive it's about 35 degrees out in the middle of December we have the top down because you got to cruise a convertible with the top down I do have the heat on so at least my feet will stay warm feels pretty solid so far good over the bumps this road's super rough uh, so you'll have a good idea on how the suspension feels but yeah I, I like it feels comfortable you could definitely cruise this car steering feels really good it's nice and tight brakes work amazing they're not dragging or pulling left or right turn signal lights up we'll see if she cancels and put this Nova up to speed oh, so This, this thing floors it. Uh, she's got pickup, it's torquey. And this is a very enjoyable ride. Cruising no problem. Feels really good. No weird vibrations or shakes in the steering. Look at this, straight down the road, 55 miles an hour. Horn works on it. Try the wipers. Wipers work, Let's see if they cancel. You gotta time it right to cancel them that's all right yeah it's solid this does have the ratchet shifter too so I bet you'd have more fun slap shifting it but even in drive just in or in yeah in drive it really took off well there you have it in this beautiful December day the 62 Nova
Well, it's a bouncy trunk. So yeah, this car is really clean. The more and more I'm looking at it, the more impressed I am. I sell cars for three times this amount of money that aren't any cleaner than this one. And the underneath is no exception. Absolutely dry, clean floors, rockers, frame rails, smooth, clean metal, painted a nice satin gloss uh, black. Up front, the steering and suspension all looks like it's been uh, rebuilt. It's all fresh looking. It is upgraded with disc brakes in front, uh, drum and back. Uh, has air shocks in the back. Fuel system was replaced, including the tank. Has a dual exhaust system with Flowmaster mufflers. Uh, look up at the motor, it's spotless. It's painted red like the car. The oil pan doesn't even have road grime on it. Uh, has a high torque starter, new flywheel cover. The fuel pump looks new. Uh, chrome oil filter canister. It is a turbo 350 automatic. This would have been a two speed power glide, now it's a turbo 350 automatic. So yeah, everything been redone on this car. You're getting, whoever buys this, getting one heck of a deal. Uh, it costs you far more to restore this car than what we're asking for it. Go to volocars.com. The salesman will help you, including how to get this delivered to your door, how to get it financed if you need it. And I keep forgetting, uh, this also has uh, an alarm with power locks and unlocks. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell icon to be notified when the next video is posted. Thanks for watching.